Hello again, Tom here from Wheeler Automotive. Today, showing you around another stunning Range Rover Sport. This is a 2012 on a 12 plate, as you can see. Uh, it's the 3 litre SDV6 with the excellent 8 speed auto. This is a 4 owner car from new, it's an HSE spec model. It's in pretty much immaculate condition the paintwork is excellent on it really really nice shine to it um, it's had the all important cam belt done it's currently on just under 83,000 miles uh, the cam belt was done at 70 something I'll put it in the uh, written text but uh, yeah it was serviced not too long ago um, it's so it's just under 83 and I think it was 81 and a half thousand miles it was serviced a couple of months ago. Start stops and drives incredibly well, it's as tight as a drum. No knocks and bangs from the uh, suspension whatsoever. It's sitting on a matching set of Goodyear Eagle F1 tyres which have all got loads of life in them. Yeah, all round this is a really, really tidy car. So it's Santorini black over an ivory leather interior. Arguably the nicest colour combo on these, but uh, let's go around it and I'll show you its fantastic condition. So up on this front uh, corner, no scratches or dings or anything, you can see the fantastic shine to this paintwork. Um, it's got auto by Zen on headlights, both the lights are crystal clear and the whole of the front end really clean. You've got like just minuscule marks like this stone chip here. That's it, you know, we're looking at tiny marks like that. All the lettering on the front's in excellent condition. There's no dents or scratches on the bonnet. The windscreen's perfect, no chips or cracks in that. Yeah, really, really clean. But look at the shine on this wing. So offside front wing in super condition. There was a slight blemish just here, look. You can see that. Now I reckon that was a bird poo that had sat on there too long. And it's just uh, reacted with the clear a little bit, but you can only really notice it up close. We've got four pretty much immaculate 20 inch wheels. This one's got a tiny curb mark there. But on the whole, all four of them look really nice. No lip on those discs, you can see they're not too old. Pads are nice and thick as well. These tyres, they're about three or four mil from the wear indicator, so you can see the amount of tread on them. Lo loads of life in these excellent tyres. Round to the driver's door. Again, look at the shine. It's like a mirror. Um, we've got a little car park door ding just there. Otherwise... I'd say that door's pretty perfect. Wing mirror's in great shape. Does have tinted glass on the B-pillar back. The offside rear door is in super condition. Is that a mark? Yeah, there's a, that's a touched in car park door ding. That's about it on that door. Does have the side steps as well. Rear quarter here is excellent. As is this offside rear wheel. Again, that's actually tyre shine, that's not a mark to the wheel. I've just had it valeted. Rear discs, just the beginning of a lip, so I think they've got loads of life in them. The pads look nice and thick, and the rear tyres, same as the front, loads of life left in them. I think these are a really good looking car. This one in particular, I think, is, is just really, really tight. No um, scrapes or marks on the, the boot lid, to be honest. The glass is lovely. Um, it's got these nice uh, chrome tailpipes, which um, aren't standard. It wouldn't have come out of the factory with them on, but I think they look really nice. It does also have power tailgate. I do have both the keys. And inside, it's just immaculate. Even the parcel shaft's really clean. Let's just push that back. So it's got this load cover in. 
and the carpet underneath is just immaculate. Got all the correct tool kit and everything, all present and correct, locking wheel nut key. Does have the reversing camera, as well as front and rear parking sensors. Both the rear lights are crystal clear, no moisture in them. Quite common for them, if they take a, even the sm smallest of knocks, they can uh, crack and let moisture in them, but these ones are perfect. Yeah, this bumper corner is excellent. It looks like there's a little chip just down here. And there's a faintest, that's a fly, but there's a faintest of scratches just here before the light. But that's the only mark on on that rear, this, this near side rear quarter. Got another lovely 20 inch wheel. This one pretty much perfect. Disc and pad, same as the other side. This tyre, same as the other side. Loads of life in it. Near side rear door, not a mark on it. Near side front door, really, really tidy. Look at the shine. Same with this uh, near side front wing. And finally, this near side front wheel, which does have a touch of curbing there. Is that a faint scratch? I think so on this arm. And a little bit of curbing around that edge, but on the whole, pretty, really presentable. Front discs, loads of life in them and the pads, same as the other side, as are the tyres. So yeah, externally, it's about as nice as a 2012 Range Rover Sport gets. Particularly the paintwork, really, really happy with how nice the paint is on this one. And I love <clears throat> this colour interior. So we've got these immaculate ivory leather seats. It's got the extended leather dash. The door cards are perfect. It's got the Harman Kardon stereo. It does have dab radio. And it also has uh, Bluetooth for your phone and it will stream music via Bluetooth as well. Rear seats, totally immaculate. Don't look like they've been sat in. The rear seats are heated as well on both sides. Yeah, really tidy inside. Another perfect door card, no marks on it whatsoever. As are the rear seats, just really, really clean. Backs of the front seats are immaculate as well. And then finally, the driver's door card, which again, just really clean. A couple of marks from opening and closing it. it does have memory the driver's seat the driver's seat itself is uh, very very clean just some very minor marks of wear from getting in and out auto buys in on headlights which i think i've said already so we can see the mileage there 82.984 let's start her up so he starts first push of the button, runs exactly as it should. I've bought and sold many, many of these cars and uh, this one runs just as well as all the others. There's such a great engine, this STV6. Um, especially when it's tied into the, turn that music down, tied to the, uh, the eight speed. Uh, quick, but also very frugal for such a, a big, heavy car. This one has got the, the later nav, it's got the dual zone climate control with air conditioning which is blowing ice cold on me right now. Do have heated front seats as well obviously. Zero issues with the suspension, goes up and down exactly as it should. We do have uh, cruise control, these are the phone um, buttons. It does have a heated steering wheel which is quite a rare option on one of these. Um, we do have flappy paddles for uh, the gearbox as well but yeah really cracking car this in super nick which has got a full service history i'm not sure if i've mentioned that or not yet but uh yeah it's it's got a full history there it is our absolutely stunning 
2012 Range Rover Sport HSE.